I'm out here by uh, the pre-trial services for Bear County. Um, <clears throat> it's right by the jail. I think it's 222 South Kamal. Anyway, you got a, a sheriff employee and someone else out here smoking. Uh, no big deal. I don't care. That's That doesn't offend me. Uh, they're away from the public areas. But uh, the reason I bring it up is because they have signs up saying there's no smoking on the whole campus. And I've had officers actually uh, come out and give me grief for smoking in the parking lot. Um, it's just something, you know, some officers will find anything they can to run you off. They don't like what you're doing. But again, I mean, the hypocrisy is what it is. You got uh, their same employees smoking on the campus. And yet, uh, one or two officers will come out and target you and make you a tyrant. How you guys doing today? I'm doing good. My name's Troy. I'm a public auditor. Uh, I'm not complaining. I know you guys are out here smoking. I don't want to, you know, take up much of your time. The, the reason I, I came to film this is because uh, it's a non-smoking campus. I don't care. You guys are out of people's way. I mean, that's the way I feel. But some of your officers will tell me I can't even smoke out in the parking lot, which is not true. Um, but, you know, as it, a, a public auditor and I see that, and I, I explain, I'm not, that's for your campus that's on the actual property. It doesn't apply to the public parking lot. Um, and, you know, when you do what I do, you get officers who just don't like what I'm doing. You notice I'm not even focusing my camera on you because that's not what the story is about. Uh, again, I don't care. You guys are being respectful. You walked all the way down here. Uh, but, I mean, when I show my viewers, I follow up on certain things like, you know, an officer telling me that. I'm like, no, nah, you can't do that. You know, and then, of course, uh, you being a, a deputy or whatever role you feel, I'm, I'm, I'm not sure. I just see the, the sheriffs. No, just the sir. Okay. So, um, you know, officers escalate and, you know, they know, well, I'll arrest you for this. And I'm like, I'm not, I'm not going to push the issue, but I know I'm right. I mean, uh, as a rights activist, that, that public parking lot, you can smoke out there on the campus. You can't. But again, um, that's just things some officers do. And when I go up and I approach you guys like, like I'm doing, I think this is the way to build relations, show you guys we're not out here to clown you. We, we, we document things for a reason, uh, things that are of interest to the public. And it also shows my viewers that, you know, not everyone who works for law enforcement or for like pretrial services are rude or nasty, you know, and they're approachable. And that's important for the public, especially in nowadays and a lot of other things that are going on where there's a lot of anti-law enforcement feelings. Because, I mean, most of my viewers, honestly, uh, are cop watchers or people that, you know, they, they want to see, you know, me getting tased and beat, you know, and, and saying nasty things to officers. Those are the types of videos that get views. That's not what I'm about. I document, you know, all kinds of things. I mean, I just documented an interview with Officer Herrera or Deputy Herrera over there. Um, and I'm like, yeah, I have to expose good contacts as well as bad contacts. Well, great. If you're going to be filming us uh, and everything, what we do here is we do uh, the video visitation. So you can, uh, if you want a video visit with an uh, inmate, you get, you get, the inmate gets two free, they're all free for everybody, two a, a week. You can do mm -hmm. as many as you want. That's what we do here for civilian employees. Okay. So uh, you can, uh, if you want a video visit, that's what we offer here. Okay. And uh, that's what we do. Okay. Well, I appreciate you letting me yeah. know that. I know they also have pre trial services in here. Yes, I mean, pre trial, re entry, you got the drug court over here, they have uh, UAs in here also. Okay. So yeah. th that's the reason you can't bring tobacco or lighters in because.